Welcome to Desert Theory. Farm edition? Well, you may be asking yourself, why is a YouTube channel named Desert Theory and the guy that's running it out in the middle of a cornfield in Panama, Iowa? It's a good question. So the first time I told Uncle Mike that I wanted to come help him farm, um, I didn't know anything about soybean harvest, corn harvest. So I was pretty nervous. I didn't want to look like I didn't know a single thing. So I used the internet to try and find something about farming. And I ended up finding a guy named uh, Zach Johnson or Minnesota Millennial Farmer. And I watched Zach for uh, quite a few of his, his videos, all he had at the time, and uh, learned as much as I could. My Uncle Mike, Uncle John, Cousin James, all those guys really know what they're doing, but for me, it's pretty much amateur hour, but I have more fun than anybody else, I think. So if you if you like what you see at all, go check out Miss Minnesota Millennial Farmer. It's a pretty cool channel. He's a pretty cool guy, Zach Johnson. He also has a race page, um, Between the Roads. So I'll put a, a link to both of those channels in the description, and uh, hopefully this is fun for you to see. Well, better get to farming. opening up a field so I'm following Mike in a grain cart I'm following him in the combine and basically it's the first time through the field so we kind of have to go you go through it and then uh, he gets full and when his hoppers full then he has to create a spot big enough see see how I couldn't get under his auger there so he'll create a spot that's big enough for me to pull underneath with the grain cart and he'll unload uh, full hopper onto the grain cart. Okay, the first and most important thing to do as a grain cart operator, turn this volume down, turn this volume up. Just kidding. Okay, so I have a uh, full grain cart now. I am heading back. I'll dump on the semi. Fill it back to the field and fill in the uh, semi again. Wagon. And from the gravity wagon 
into the auger. So there's no semi involved anymore. So we just used to have to use this gravity wagon as a spot to put the corn to get it down into that hopper like we were doing before with the semi. So uh, this goes pretty quick. We're taking a lot of corn out. So for anybody that doesn't actually understand what we're combining, it's just corn. And what it does is it, it just dries, it dies and then dries like this. And so that combine removes the husk and then takes each one of these individual kernels off to where that's what we're dumping into the grain bins is just all those individual kernels. You know, I think most people dream of their nephew coming out from Oregon and videotaping their every move. Is that true? That is not true. Well, we're back in Oregon. We're finished with farming and we are pumped to get going on this uh, so we can get over to Milliken, do some testing, see what it can do, show you guys what it can do. So uh, look for us next week. We'll be back to working on race cars and not farming.